Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Cassie if you're new here and welcome to Cassie's Castle. Today's video, we are going to the thrift store today to look for some Disney bounds. I have done this video a couple times before, so I'm really excited and you guys always seem to like it and request that I do more of it. So I'm really excited to go today and hopefully we can put together some really exciting looks. I also was thinking maybe we could name this series and call it Bounding on a Budget. I think that's kind of cute. Let me know what you guys think. Today we have a couple of outfits I really want to put together. I don't know if they're more Disney bounds or if they're low-key costumes. Like I'm not really bounding. I just want to like recreate the look for today's video. If you guys are interested in today's video, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up. Make sure you guys subscribe for more and let's get into it. I usually go to Savers because that's like the closest near me. There aren't really that many thrift stores near me, which is kind of surprising. You would think there'd be more, but we're gonna go to Savers and see what we can find. I'm gonna go and get some food. I really love this little coffee shop. They have a couple locations in my area. It's called Mademoiselle Colette, and I've been there with Ingrid a couple times. It's so good. Like, I love the coffee. They have great avocado toast. So I'm gonna go there and I'm gonna start my morning off there. Tuesdays are my one day off of work and so I really try and get as much done on Tuesdays that, that I possibly can for the channel and for my other social media stuff. So I'm gonna go get some food first, take some pictures by myself. So that's exciting. It always stresses me out when I go and take my tripod by myself. I also need to get my nails done today because I don't know if you guys have noticed. I'm sure you guys have. They're literally so bad. Like, are you kidding me? They're just really outgrown. So I need to get my nails done at some point today. So yeah, that's the plan for today. Also, my allergies have been messing me up. I feel like I haven't had a good night's sleep in like two or three days because my allergies are so bad. Like I feel like I keep taking allergy pills and it's just not doing anything for me. And I've switched my allergy medication so many times and I just like don't know what to do about it. Like I'm just allergic to life. Um, that's basically it. Anyways, we're gonna go get some food, some coffee because I'm running on like no sleep. Before we leave, we gotta do an outfit of the day. I'm wearing this off the shoulder sweater. Basically everything was in my recent dis uh, clothing haul that I posted. The sweater is from H&M. I'm wearing my heart jeans. You can't really see. They have little hearts. These are from Forever 21. Got my Nikes. These are from the kids section at Nike, which we love. And then these are Truly Enchanted Shop. This is Forever 21. This is Disney these Disney necklaces, Disney earrings. The tote bag is from Brandy Melville. And I actually need a jacket because I feel like it's gonna be extra cold. So we made it to the coffee shop and they actually don't have ice today, so I kind of get a latte, so we're going to have to go to Starbucks after, but I got some avocado toast, and you guys, I met a subscriber <laughs> at the coffee shop, which is so exciting, so I met a subscriber. Hi. Do you want to introduce yourself? My name is Giovanna, and I love Cassie. She's so sweet and so nice to meet She's here. super nice. I was so nervous. I was like, oh my gosh, I'm a little nervous. <laughs> no, you're so cute. Thank you <laughs> Thank so you. much. Just finished eating. Now I'm going to go embarrass myself in public and take some pictures of myself. I'm so excited. character that we're recreating is Penny Proud. She has like a pink cardigan and like a little white top and a red skirt, which we like. I found this skirt, which I feel like is pretty perfect for the outfit. I'm kind of struggling finding the cardigan because I haven't really found like a cardigan section. All I see are like long sleeve jacket sweatshirts and no cardigans, so. Again, 
I feel like matches the color pretty well. Found so many cardigan options. I just can't decide what color matches better. This one looks a little too pink. And I love the color of this one. There's also this one. This is like super hot pink. This is like too purple, I think. And this one, I just don't like the ruffles on it. So I don't know. I ended up finding this like um, polo shirt and I think the outfit is complete. So now we're gonna do another one. The next outfit I wanna do is her doing, like her, the artist, when she did Beauty and the Beast and she's in her blue outfit. So it's gonna be a little bit harder cause it's like actual like costumey kind of outfit. at this blue dress because of the shape here but I feel like it's too dark of a blue this had like a lower neckline this would be so perfect I kind of think this belt will work for the dress I also ended up finding this blouse with like the perfect sleeves and then I think if we unbutton it it'll look more like hers here's what I came up with I think I'm gonna take this dress and then maybe we can cut the straps to make it hang down a little bit lower. And then with the belt, I think this is actually pretty perfect. I love it. I'm gonna go through everything that I found, our Beauty and the Beast outfit. And I have my Penny Proud outfit. And then I also found like things that aren't for the challenge. But okay, I found it from this. And I also found that this one, I think I'm going to take the Champion crew neck. These from Target, but I think it'd be really cute with the new airy leggings that I got. So, yeah, I think I'm going to do the crew neck one, as if I need more. I also saw this coat, which I don't know what I would wear with this. Um, it was more of like if I could think of like a costume I could do, but I, I thought it was pretty nice. It's $7 or $10. But I don't think I'd ever wear it, and I also don't know what character I could use this for. I also found these brown jeans. Can't tell if these are straight leg or skinny jeans, because if they're straight leg, I'm down to that. Okay, this one is kind of crazy. I'm stressed, and I don't know what I would do with it, but part of me like doesn't want to leave it. Like I don't know what costume or bound I could do. It's really pretty and in really great condition. Like look at these sleeves. <laughs> and then I found these pants and they're like striped like trousers. I hope they fit me. I also found this really pretty slip dress. I also found this skirt. But I think I'm just gonna do the dress instead of the skirt. I also found this cardigan, which kind of reminds me of like Love Shack Fancy, which is why I picked it up. It's size large, so it might be too big for me to wear. I just like that it's like velvet. So I found this blazer, and this is so freaking cute. I need to try it on because it's like baby pink. It's like adorable. I love it. Then the last thing that I found is another pink cardigan. Can you tell me the different color is? I don't know if you can tell. It's like hard to envision it with this like sweater. I kind of think this would be cute with the slip underneath. Lots of jewelry. I don't know, that's like kind of how I'm envisioning it. Isn't that kind of pretty? I like kind of like that. Here's the cardigan. I don't think I like the shape of it that much. So I'm gonna leave this one. to do a little try on haul i have been out and about literally all day and i'm so happy to be home i like cannot wait to take a shower and get into bed i'll show you guys my nails i did go to the nail salon and we got these really pretty valentine's nails 
how cute i know i want to try everything on and let you guys know my thoughts on everything i want to try on this champion sweater this was at 7.99 and i thought it was so cute and i feel like this color is like really trendy right now so it's kind of a good find here's what the sweater looks like i mean it's just a plain boring sweater and i really don't need more but since i bought a new one that means i need to get rid of one in my closet at this point I need to get rid of like five because i definitely have so many new sweatshirts it's under ten dollars i love it and i pulled out my leggings to see if they match and they literally do not match it's a much lighter purple unfortunately still happy with like the fuchsia color i honestly think i could still wear them together i don't know if it'll be like too much actually let's try it all on right now it doesn't look bad together i mean it's definitely like a lot of purple going on i don't know not sure if i love it together i'd probably just wear this with like some black leggings but it's fine it's fine we're moving on i want to try on the penny proud outfit next this was the skirt that we ended up getting and this says it's a size of five six it doesn't look like a five six so curious to see what it looks like on this was 4.79 the cardigan we went with this color i had to call kayla and she helped me out and told me that this is the perfect color for it so i'm glad we found this one this one was $5.49. This is originally from H&M. Actually, there was so much H&M at the thrift store. I also got this polo shirt. I feel like a school uniform shirt. This was $4.49. This is a size medium, so it's definitely going to be big on me. But, you know, it'll do for the one photo that I need in this. My Savers doesn't have a fitting room, so I was only able to try on, like, jackets and stuff. Besides that, like... I was just kind of risking it all when I bought everything. Here is the Penny Proud look. This tag is huge. Um, I think it's perfect. Literally does what it needs to do. The skirt is definitely big on me, but it doesn't fall down, which is great. I could probably belt it, though, to make sure that it stays up when I take my pictures. I think I explained what the Penny Proud outfit is for there is a challenge on instagram going on right now it happens every single february for black history month and it's called babity bobbity black my first year i was aqua from the cheetah girls the second year i did zendaya from or rocky zendaya from shake it up this year i'm gonna do a penny proud and i'm really excited about it and yeah i've never done the penny proud outfit i'm excited about it but if you guys want to participate it's literally open to anyone a couple weeks left until the end of february so definitely go and participate if you don't decide to participate i've been sharing on my stories every single day the featured creator for the day so definitely go and support new black disney creators anyways love the pit and it slays um can't wait to take these pics i want to try on these jeans these are h&m jeans and i was concerned that they would be a little bit too small so wish me luck here are what the jeans look like and they actually fit me pretty perfectly love it the only thing is they're not i don't know if they're straight leg jeans but they're definitely like tapered at the bottom but they're not skinny jeans it's like kind of hard to show you no free feet pics. Yeah, I'm not sure if I love the fit of the bottom of the jeans, but I've been wanting like brown cargos or brown flare jeans or just like any brown pants for a while now. And so I was just really happy that I could find them at the thrift store for literally $7. So that was a sleigh. Should we try this bell outfit on? I just know it's going to look ridiculous on me because I need to like cut it and figure it out. I put the shirt on and i don't know if this dress is going to fit it's an extra small and there's no zipper or anything so i'm not even gonna attempt to do it because it's gonna stress me out if i can't get myself out of it i do plan on cutting the straps and adding like a ribbon just to make it a little bit more similar to hers stay tuned for that we're not gonna keep trying this on it's just too much for right now but i'm gonna try on the white slip dress this dress is definitely my favorite find of the day you guys, it looks so good. I think I need to adjust the straps in the back. How cute is this? Like, this would be so cute with some knee-high boots, um, even some Converse to make it casual. I'm obsessed. This is so freaking cute. For $4, are you freaking kidding me? That was definitely a steal. Here's my little pink blazer. I don't know what the brand is. The brand is Kenzie, which I don't know where that's sold. I kind of feel like Kohl's sells that brand, but I don't know. 
this pink blazer is so freaking cute honestly looks so cute with this dress underneath like isn't that adorable when my hair looks better with like some cute little heels stop and a little purse <gasps> i love it wow this is such a great find and then you can roll the sleeves up and there's like a little polka dot i don't know if you can tell but it's like white and pink polka dot lining so freaking cute i'm obsessed this is definitely like my favorite find Obviously, I'm happy that I found, like, those Disney-bound outfits. This whole outfit right here is $15. That's literally robbery. That is the end of today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I highly, highly recommend. I know I do lots of clothing hauls on this channel and on TikTok and stuff. I definitely recommend going thrifting. It is a lot of work, and you kind of have to dig through everything. Like, it literally is, like, a whole day of finding things. But especially if you're, like, in the Disney bounding space um, and you want to recreate looks, like, the thrift store is where to go. It is so much more affordable than going on Amazon or anything and you don't feel as bad when you only get to wear it once like you can just wear it once and take it back to the thrift store honestly that's it for today's video I hope you guys enjoyed it if you guys did make sure you guys give it a thumbs up make sure you guys subscribe make sure you guys follow me on Instagram and TikTok so that way you guys can stay up to date when I do put these looks together that's where I'll be posting the final reveal I love you guys so much and I will see you guys in the next one bye guys I desperately need to take a shower after wearing all these clothes I feel disgusting. <laughs>